Hello, Patreon back. What's up, guys? In this video, we're back with another scary video. Another uh, real ghost caught on camera. Let's dive in and check this out. Top five ghosts caught on camera. Seance Witch. Paranormal investigator Brad Mack and his team were investigating a place called The Cage in a little town called St. Ozeth in England. The I don't like any of this so far. Seance Witch. The house is called The Cage in a little creepy town in England. I'm getting bad vibes. Down and the side has a dark history. Starting in the year 1582, this building was used as a prison, but not just any prison. The jail was used to confine and execute women convicted of witchcraft. Brian Mack says that during his paranormal investigation, his team heard strange footsteps and whispers. They saw lights flicker for no reason, and they even felt something bite or pinch them on several occasions. One member of their team named Vanessa was so shaken that she absolutely refused to stay in the building after dark. But the most bizarre incident was yet to come. Late that night, the group decided to perform a seance no. to contact the ghost of the convicted women who had died there. As Brian Mack watched and recorded from another room, he saw something very strange happen to a woman in the group. Let's ask him for trouble. Whoa. Oh my god! He changed? Doesn't even look like a person? Whoa! Her face changed! No face, her eyes. Her... He saw something very strange happen to a woman so in the room. She goes away, comes back. Face is completely changed? Mouth, but... Doesn't even look like a person? Right, Debbie, you need to come down here for a minute, please. Why don't they ask her to go there? Why is Face has completely changed. Doesn't even look like a person. Right, Debbie, you need to come down here for a minute, please. One seance member's face actually begins to change and contort into something that can only know, be maybe described. Maybe she was just talking and horrific. smiling. Her nose and... seems to grow and her mouth stretches into a bizarre, inhuman grin, right in front of their camera. Fearing for the woman's safety. They call down and remove her from the group. After the seance, the woman has a strange burn mark down the back of her neck, even though she had been dressed in several layers of clothing. She later said that after the incident, she experienced horrible nightmares and bizarre occurrences around her home. So, was this some supernatural possession by a ghost caught on camera, or just a bizarre trick of the light? Let me know what you think down in the comments. That's a good start. The Vickers Hill Ghost. I don't know. The city of Armagh in Northern Ireland has a grim and ghostly past. The city is one of the oldest in Ireland and is believed to have been an ancient pagan ceremonial spot. The site of Vickers Hill in Armagh is said to be one of the most haunted areas of the city, home to the infamous Green Lady Ghost. Green lady in this ghost. clip, a woman driving her car on Vickers Hill doesn't see the green lady, but does catch a strange supernatural encounter all her own. Whoa! Oh, you can see through her! No! The man in the video seems to walk across the road and disappear right into a wall that surrounds the Church of Ireland Cathedral. In the middle of the day. He seems to be dressed in Georgian fashion. Look, you can see through it. Style of clothing that hasn't been worn in the city for over 200 years. Fuck! Singapore Highway Ghost. Oddly enough, this next video was posted to the Singapore road safety site, roads.sg, a site which usually posts videos and information about Singapore traffic. The post shows someone driving on a busy Singapore highway late at night and they spot something very unexpected in the middle of the road. Where is it? Are you getting creeped out by the music? Yes! <laughs> the music is really creepy. Yeah, you gotta say Nuke's Top 5, he does the music really good.
image of the girl Come in both on. the trunk Can't you. and rear dash cams. Dave! The story was that's picked up sign, by several right? online tabloid no, sites, that's a, that's and some a viewers suggested that the girl seemed to be floating wow. in the road. Now, to me, it actually looks like a girl balancing herself on the divider in the middle of a very dangerous highway, <laughs> which is pretty bizarre either way. But what do you think? Is it just a dangerous balancing act? Or is it a ghost caught on camera? That's crazy as fuck. Let me that's know a person. down in the comments. Wait, what are you doing? Bank ghost. I don't know about that. You know, maybe just a real person. Yeah, but. A real girl. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It could be. Yeah. Could be. Could be a ghost. Still creepy. Could be a ghost. Ghost girl. Workers at the Credit Bank BCP in Peru were hanging out after business hours having a chat as one of them tested out the camera on his new phone. Suddenly, he catches something very strange in the background of the video. Oh, his workmate that he just saw the shadowy figure of a little girl run behind him. His co workers don't seem to believe him, so the man goes to check, but nothing there. Whoa. Whoa. But a second bank security camera shows the bank's front door seeming to open. And she walked out. And then close, all on their own. Secret. Damn, I gotta oh say, God. this video is, is is making me start to believe in ghosts. Swimmer. Kim Davison and her friend Jesse took their children swimming at Lockyer Creek in Queensland, Australia. At one point, Kim's daughter claimed that she felt something grabbing her leg, but her mom thought nothing of it. Assuming the girl had just brushed up against a stick or some other piece of debris floating in the water. Later, Kim took a photo of herself, Jesse, and their three children splashing around in the creek. But when Kim looked back at her photo, she saw something that chilled her to the core. There appeared to be a fourth ghost child swimming right along beside them. At the back. After the strange photo was posted to Facebook, the story became even creepier. One viewer did a little digging and discovered that a young girl named Doreen O'Sullivan had drowned at that exact spot 100 years earlier. So is this just a strange reflection in the water? Or is this little Doreen O'Sullivan's goat? Yeah, I mean, let's look at that for a little sec. Yeah. I mean, Does it, it look like the, a little it, girl? It could be the sun going over like a stone or... But, but that looks like a head. That looks like a head. But... Mm. I don't know. But what about the story? The girl, the little girl said she was swimming and she felt something yeah, grab her leg. Is, yeah. That's like the scariest thing. Like something trying to pull you under the water. Yeah, there's some st strange thing floating there and uh, yeah, the creepy story. Yeah. Ghost caught on camera. <sighs> That's I don't know about the last one. No. No, it's not scary. Yeah, uh, the, number two, the little kid video, that's the best. Run through the bank? Yeah, that's really good, me chose. Maybe this one, the number one is not scary, but it's creepy. Like, all these videos are really creepy. Like, number four, the guy just walked into a vault. Yeah, number that one, good too. Number three, give me a jump scare from hell. Mm -hmm. Like, these were all really creepy. Mm -hmm. Like, I'm creeped up. I'm creeped. I, I might be start believing ghosts a little bit. Well, believe it or not, there's still something that is just beyond our understandings. Yeah. So, hope you guys enjoyed this video and thanks for all the supports. Love you guys. See you next Bye. time. Bye.